Final lady is recognized for two minutes. Thank you, Mr. Speaker. I rise in support of this bill for emergency funding for Israel and for U.S. military operations in the Middle East. On October 7, 2023, Hamas terrorists brutally attacked Israel, murdering, maiming, and raping innocent women, men, and ch children, taking 240 hostages, many who remain in dark tunnels, being starved and abused. And adding fuel to the fire, Iran proxies are shooting rockets into Israel, jeopardizing commerce in the Red Sea, and killing American soldiers on military bases. Funds from this bill will enable Israel to defend itself and the U.S. to protect our own military personnel. Mr. Speaker, I recognize and I respect the concern of friends who support Israel but want other issues also important to be addressed. But Mr. Speaker, the perfect should not be the enemy of the good. And let me be clear, my vote will be for what is in this proposed bill and not a, rebu a, rebu a rebuke of what is left out. I fear that a divided Congress will embolden Israel's adversaries and put our own military in harm's way. Israel's security is our security. I stand with Israel, I stand with humanity, and I urge my colleagues to join me in supporting this bill. And I yield back.